Hi everybody, welcome back to Cooking with Grandpa. This is Joe. Today we're gonna to make something special. It's a little different, but I think you're gonna like it. It's called a oatmeal, but made Italian style. It's Italian style only because I'm Italian and I thought it up and I make it this way and I love it. You're gonna like it, it's nutritious and delicious. We're gonna start right now. I'm using steel cut oats. These are Trader Joe's. I don't use the other oats, the instant oats. These you have to cook for about 35 minutes. They're the best. Don't use the instant. Now, according to the recipe, I'm going three times their recipe. You can look at the box and you can see. So what we gotta do is we gotta put our water in here and we gotta set it to a boil. And when that boils, I'm gonna come back to you and we'll, and we'll get started with the rest. Okay, we got it coming to a boil, right? It's coming to a boil, we're gonna add a little bit of salt, about a quarter teaspoon. And according to the directions on the box, we're gonna throw in our oatmeal. So give it a stir. Make sure nothing's sticking to the bottom. And what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna put this on the simmer uh, burner. Because I just want this to simmer real nice and slow without the cover on. You don't put the cover back on. And you're gonna have this just to a simmer for 35 minutes. I'll get back to you when the 35 minutes is up and we'll take it from there. Stick with me. Okay, here we are. It's not quite 35 minutes, it's about 30. But we got it to the to the uh, consistency that we want. It's almost like polenta or, or uh, grits, cornmeal. I love these kind of cereals. That's a good consistency. That's what we want, and it's cooked. Don't use the instant, remember. Now I'm gonna take this over and I'm gonna pour it into my, into this nice dish. Almost like bland. Okay. Now, you can, you can use all the vegetables that you like. And in summer I had my kale and my Swiss chard. We made two videos with kale, fresh kale, how we made it, and Swiss chard over macaroni. Now this year I didn't have any of those vegetables, so I have some broccoli. I, I steamed them up, putting it in here, nice like this. Oh, well, before I do that, I wanted to put my olive oil in a little bit and mix it up. Give it a nice shot, a nice virgin olive oil. Instead of butter, we're using olive oil. That's what makes it Italian uh, instead of American. And then we put our uh, broccoli or whatever vegetable you like, kale, Swiss chard, spinach, mix it up. Give it a little mix. And then you add your little pecorino romano. How can you go wrong with this like this? I'm not telling you. You're gonna love this. Look at that. That's nutritious and delicious. You're gonna love me, stick with it. Your doctor's gonna love it too. Okay, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget our other videos up here. And uh, also uh, get notified, ring the bell. Thanks for watching.